making it this far in the bracket. Mm -hmm. Okay, going uh, Nitro going his original character in Smash yeah. 4 with the Sonic. Uh, I've seen enough Battle Networks and Sonics uh, over there to, oh, yeah. to know that uh, this is still a very good character. Shoutouts to Dominican Republic. Hope you guys are watching and enjoying right now. Here we go. Uh, just uh, starting off on uh, Smashville. Looks uh, blah, blah, blah. FD. That's definitely not Smashville. I don't know. What, I don't know what I'm saying, guys. I'm a bad shout out, shout out to his tag, uh, Evoker. That's uh, I know Case was a fan of Persona series. So it's from Persona Three. But we'll see how Case can do against Nitro here, finding himself at winner semis. Okay. All right, both of them respecting each other's space. I feel like Case is kind of trying to wait to see how he does his spin dash mix-ups. Yeah. Uh, to try and maybe intercept with like a fair or a nair or something like that, using those long-lasting hitbox to try and stop him in his mm -hmm. tracks. Definitely trying to feel out how Nitro's going to be playing with those spin dashes there. Going to get hit by that trampoline. Case goes back onto the stage and misses the grab there, and Nitro gets that forward tilt with two hits into it. All right. Tries to use that homing dash mix-up. Oh. Of course, homing attack, you can wait it out a bit more, charge a bit more before you release it. That keeps your character guessing when you're going to oh. have to try and parry. Almost gets that up smash, and Sonic able to narrowly escape him with a homing attack. Alright, Nitro still doing a good job of keeping up the control. And yeah, yeah, I, I can see why Nitro picked up uh, picked this matchup, just uh, using that speed to just keep hit um, at bay and not being able to use uh, like his strong normals and aerials. Yeah, and unfortunately he can't just pin that off the side B. Of course, the startup takes a little bit while to get invincibility for that side B. Alright, 184 percent. One throw will be able to do it, but he's gonna try and go for something here. Nice, able to use the upper dash arm to come back to the ledger. Invincibility coming in the nick of time, but that homing attack stalls him for just a slight second and still able to get Casos and the stock. Yeah, I feel like Roll was probably not the right option there. Maybe neutral get with the shield. But that was just a tough call to, to make there. We, we didn't know when Nitro was going to release yeah. that homing attack. So good stuff uh, to Nitro taking out that first stock. And again, using that spacing game, just uh, staying right outside of Pit's normals and aerials. So want to get intercepted too often. Nice, catches them all with a dash attack there. Not going to kill, though. But you can definitely tell Nitro doesn't want to lose the stock. Then he comes in with a spin dash to the homing attack. Another one there. He's tough call for Case with He's having a tough time fighting away from Nitro. And Nitro's just been going for these little... Oh my god, man. That man's relentless with those homing attacks. Kevin, or excuse me, Case kind of has a little annoyed face right now. He just got hit by homing attack like he, six times. Yeah, I was going to say. He got hit homing attack from one side of the ledge to the other. That, that yeah. really hurts. Oh, SD? No, no, not quite. I like it. Try to use the Guardian Noble Tars to actually move Sonic away from the ledge, though, but that backer will take it. Nitro, so far, running around Case Wiz, and he hasn't been able to just stop and catch, and catch him. Yeah. It's, it's kind of tough. I mean, uh, Pit doesn't quite have the best aerial mobility. Of course, yeah. he's got those double jumps, but at the same time, he sacrifices a little bit of mobility for that, so a fast character like Sonic is going to be able to intercept them really easily. Double jumps? I was going to say, Pit has uh, four jumps, my friend. <laughs> All right, well, hold on, we'll see what Casewis can do. Trying to stall himself back on the stage there, but Nitro still using his back ass. And a downer, okay. And that's going to connect smash, anything. Yeah. He got that Meteor afterwards and a really great follow-up afterwards. Going to try to make it back to the stage. Yeah, yeah it'll be fine. Casewis doesn't try to go for anything too crazy. He's got a really high deficit, and Nitro looking like he's trying to run away with this first game. With, right there, the Molly Wop. Going to take that first game. Shout out to Larry. I would not want to do that again sometime. That was not fun for Kingsley. And yeah. you can definitely tell, like, he, didn't, he he had some signs of frustration in that matchup there. One of them was being the homing attack. And at that point, that got into his head. You can yeah. tell. Like, I'm literally getting homing attack from one side of the stage to the other. And it kind of defeats you mentally, but hopefully Kingsley can bring himself back. I mean, he's got, had a pretty good day today, beating out Nico from the 818. Mm -hmm. So we'll see what he can do here. I think uh, one thing he can do, uh, potentially, I mean, he, if he's already getting mixed in the in the homing attack combo, then mm -hmm. it's going to be a little bit harder. But if he can keep his distance away from homing attack, yeah. he should be able to wait for the little zing and then potentially get like a parry or something like that yeah. afterward. It is possible. Hard, mind you, but it is, it is possible. Yeah. So he's just going to have to see what cases can do. But he's switching to the Lucina. Case was just kind of told me this is one of the characters he's been also looking to pick up. We saw Case was use Wolf for a little while, then he went back to Pit. And we talked to him, you're like, hey man, it's not that bad, but if you want to use him, go for it. And then Case was eventually made like, hey, I like how Lucina plays, I know you've been using Lucina, so we'll see what she can do and put her put her good use here. Hopefully it'll be a lot different from Pit. Yeah. 
I mean, if, uh, the, the hitbox aren't multi-hit, so it, maybe there, maybe case with things there will be a little bit more reliable. You know, just some stronger normals and aerials this time around. It's working out a little bit. He's being able to intercept it, but still, Sonic speed kind of makes it difficult for Lucina to get things started. Case was trying to use these aerials to catch Nitro in the air, but unfortunately. Taking some percent in the middle for it, especially on the landings there, and Nitro gets a little bit of the up air into the floor tilt. I think that's, that's a, a mix-up that uh, we see more often coming from Sonics now that uh, Spin Dash to... I don't know if Spin Dash to Shield is immediately gone or if it, it just got nerfed or something. But uh, yeah, we, really, we see, yeah, we see that option just so they can stay in place after Spin Dash. Oh, before smashing out spaces, Case was on the return there. Case was... Take some time to take a breather there. I like that he stole himself there at the Angel platform. Want to see what he did wrong. Gets that back air. Trying to go for a deep edge, some like side edge guard there. Yeah. Able to find it. Look like he tried to get maybe a uh, a stage spike or something like that. Yeah. Not quite working out. Or a jump root possibly as well. That would have been big for Casey's as well. Yeah. Let's see if Casey's gonna try to close out the stock real soon. Footstool. I like it. <sighs> and take it back. Yeah. It's Casey was. This is literally the cat and mouse game that we know. Uh, oh, the aerial <laughs> directional air dodge! I love it. He's able to make it back in time. But yeah, I feel like this is the cat and mouse game that we know Sonic has been able to do uh, mm -hmm. in previous games, and we're seeing it again. It's just making oh, it so well, difficult. So close for Case was to really get anything. Finally, gonna get a grab back. Throw him off. Nice. See, so see if he try to get something here. Uh, Forward to able to look like it poked through a shield and a downer, not gonna kill. Case was still surviving that downer a second time. Yeah, Nitro's just been added at every point on his offense. Finally, oh no, he still survives actually! And I love that Drift 2 just staying right outside of that forward air, just making sure K Swiss is not confident in his edge guard. This is looking really rough. It, it's really rough too. He's still been getting hit by that homing attack. That back air catching K Swiss going slipping for the forward air. K Swiss just having a hard time just trying to get through Nitro. He come, tries to come in with a neutral, but Nitro immediately comes out with the dash attack. I'm sorry, the homing attack. Dude, Sonic is so dash, good. Dash, dash. Sonic is so good. In this this character was not nerfed. Yeah. <laughs> this character he, was just changed. He's just slightly different, that's all. But yeah. it allows him to be a little bit more aggressive. Uh, in certain options, going to get an up air. Tries to get a double up air. Going to have to go for the landing option. Case was not capitalizing on it. Nice. Finally gets that there. He's been looking for it all match long. but Oh, man. That took so long to get the stock. But at least he got a stock. Yeah. So it, it's something. It, it, it's not all hope is lost. What's he gonna do here? Oh no! He tried to get the forward smash, but it moved his hurt box. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> Damn, man. I am so sad. I, I was like, no, okay, so don't do it. Don't just stand there. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> You're yeah. Gonna I, I was like, <laughs> that, I was like, that, for, that forward smash range is like really. <laughs> Really deceiving. That's unfortunate, man. Yeah, that, that hurt, dude. Yeah, case was you can already see his face. He's kind of like, oh, what do I do? <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much, Deathbat Jr. Of course, that is D bad. Thank you so much for subbing the 2 GG. He even said it himself, case was. Oh, he man. tried to go for the forward smash, but move his hurt box closer to that F smash from Sonic. Yeah. Let's, uh, let's, uh. Oh. It would have been is a there? read. It would have definitely been like something to get too. It would have been definitely a momentum swinger. Possibly it would have killed Nitro, but unfortunately that was too much of the cost and none of the reward. Hopefully Casewas can change it with another attempt from a different pit this time, and it's gonna be dark pit. Yeah. I'm so I'm really glad that Nitro actually does have this character uh, still locked into because yeah. uh, if uh, if it was a pit against Belmont, that definitely would have been a lot harder because yeah. of the the orbit arcs, of course. Definitely why you see the switch for Nitro, not going for the Belmont, just going for Sonic. Okay. Neutral yeah, this is a, the pit that we want to see using that really strong Nair to keep people at the ledge and maintain his neutral advantage. Yeah, Nair starts up at frame 4. And the last hit of Nair will hit at frame 25. Okay, keeping up his distance. Gonna be just fine so far at the ledge. Okay, yeah, uses that armor. He went right through that homing attack. He's fine right now. Definitely a much better game. I don't know what it was. Maybe he saw something when he was getting bopped with uh, Lucina <laughs> and then switching to the pit. His main oh, actually made things air. more comfortable. Great air dodge read, but not quite going to be able to get the stock. Nitro still going to be able to survive. Back air so strong. If you actually manage to get the, the pretty much the tipper of it, that's 12% too as well. 
Mm, I don't know if Nitro's trying to play with his food or he's just trying to be a little bit different to try to keep K Swiss on his toes. He's just throwing out that F smash a lot. Yeah. I don't know I don't know quite I don't know quite what his motivation is yet. I mean, he kinda feels like he's probably got a little bit of K Swiss in his head too. I'm not gonna lie, the way things have been going after the last two games. Stalls himself for that homing attack. Case was still getting hit by him. He was able to get away from that back end. That out smash on the stage. Case was finally finding a proper stock with a good lead early on. But that back, that fourth throw, I like it. Sets himself for the edge guard phase. And that four air, man. Yeah. Nitro Relentless. It's still a really good edge guard tool, even in this game, too. And uh, people don't fall out of it as much anymore. So it's yeah. a really great option, actually. Fair out of shield. I like it. Some of Sonic's. Uh, out of shield options are a little bit weird because that fair and that bear kind of can go over short characters. But yeah. if your character is trying to intercept you in the air, then it's still good at uh, mixing it up on air to air. Um, out of shield. Yeah, the arrow's not quite doing uh, much justice for Nitro. Or Nitro, excuse me. Okay, I was going to say, I thought that homing attack was actually going to hit. Okay, so this time around again. This is the Electroshock on to come back on the stage. Unfortunate uh, shield drop there from Nitro. It gave Case was just enough time to be able to intercept him. But he's going, coming back with a Falling Nair into a Fortune. I like that. Still maintaining that control, and I like that. Mixing up his landings. Throwing out a lot of hitboxes. It just looks like Case was can't keep up that pressure right now. Mm -hmm. Bit of a deficit in percent between Case and Nitro, but he's able to get away from that forward smash. I like that he's using the Silver Bow there to just close the gap there. It's 5% every time he gets the hit. Oh, and unfortunately, he gets the wrong angle of the up B. Yeah, that was unfortunate. I mean, he missed the tech, so I'm sure that he wanted to do an immediate one, but it didn't quite angle it correctly, so that's unfortunate. Yeah, not only that, the power of fly of the up B actually is intangible from frame 15 to 19, but unfortunately, the angle. All right, let's see if uh, Casus can try keeping his head together. Uh, he did kind of look down and shake his head, so I hope he keeps it together. Yeah. Because uh, once Nitro has gotten a really solid lead, it's really difficult for Casus to make it back usually. Oh, nice. Still using the Electroshock arm to come back on the stage and able to power through the trampoline. Man, his normals are so fast. He's just been able to get out of close boxing situations with that Forza, with that jab, before things got a little bit too scary against k -Swiss. Still potential for k -Swiss to make this back, but I feel like Nitro pretty much got this in the bag if I was a betting man. Yeah. k -Swiss, though, I like it. Looking for the spacing here and see the Nitro went for the other side of the stage. Still trying to find an edge guard here. Hold the shield, there it is, finally able to get away from the homing attack, but not from the trampoline. Yeah. Get that chase? Oh, dash attack, that'll do it. Yeah, I'll do it, all the way from the ledge, even gets the tip hit of dash attack. Mm -hmm. One more homing attack, though. Oh, okay, be oh no, he doesn't get the invincibility from the upper dash arm. Uh,